here. You're Inshallah. already here, trust me. Then, inshallah, the $10 million is on its way. Inshallah. 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 <laughs> Sheikh Hassan, just... be a check? <laughs> 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 oh, by the way, before we do anything else, Fahad, mm. I think it's imperative at this point in the game to mention something that uh, we do have a website, a very important website, which is Huda.tv. Mm. Now, what I just found out yesterday, you didn't even know this, that Huda.com is also ours now. Mm. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So he was telling me, no, it's Huda.tv. No, and I said, no, it's Huda.com. He said, no. And I said, okay. <laughs> and I showed him on his computer. We <laughs> have to make a problem. Sheikh Asim is still online. Yes. I yes. would love to hear from him. Sheikh Asim, Sheikh Asim, if you can, if you can, if you can share with us how important you think it is for us to keep going and expanding Huda to all the different languages we were just talking about. بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وآله وصحبه ومن تدى بهداه. I think it's uh, very important not to expand only Huda TV to different languages uh, uh, in the world, but to promote Dawa whenever and wherever we are. Yes. And this is the role of a true practicing Muslim. It's not of concern of him only to spread uh, uh, the Dawa in one language, but in all languages, to yes. all the places, and to spread the da'wah and the deen mm. to all mankind, because this was the role of our Prophet ﷺ. And this is what he wanted for the whole humanity, not to the Arabs, not to a certain particular uh, uh, race, but to the whole humanity, but not only humanity, but even the jinn. Mm. And I believe, I believe that <laughs> we have to sustain uh, a fixed income to uh, Huda TV so that it would continue, inshallah, for years and years to come. Mm. I feel ashamed when I compare our work, our uh, waqf and, and, and charity uh, that is uh, devoted to supporting da'wah, to supporting uh, different uh, activities and spreading the deen of, of, of Islam, when I compare this to the other religions. And if we look at the Vatican itself, we find that it has billions and billions of budgets per year yes. for spreading their religion. And this means that these people are working hard to support their religion. Now, we believe that our religion is the final and the true religion of Allah the Almighty. Yet, we fail to uh, dedicate businessmen who spend millions and millions of dollars on silly things and supporting things that do not relate to Islam, yet we can't, is it logical that we can't find one Muslim uh, a person, a businessman who devotes his money, he, who lives for the cause? Mm. This is something that is beyond my uh, uh, reasoning and, and understanding and comprehension. So I believe that we, first of all, for Huda need a good marketing team that oh. sets, sets a good marketing marketing strategy a good marketing a, that uh, a plan that can be implemented and with the grace of allah it takes few months and it's on its feet hitting the ground running besides all of this we should not neglect the small donors those who donate because of the love of allah mm -hmm. and they are by the millions of uh, watching Huda. If we need That's to have true. this body in England or in uh, the Caribbean or in, in, in the, uh, you know, uh, somewhere in, in these islands to have this entity or body that can accept donations, that has auditors, that is uh, yearly, uh, the, the balance sheet is revised by uh, uh, legal entities mm -hmm. to know that everything is legit. And but with the grace of Allah, believe me, with one dollar of each viewer, we could have miracles and oh, yeah, wonders. True, true, true. Sheikh, true. Sheikh, Sheikh Asim, Jazakallah Khair for tuning in. I'm glad Sheikh Asim is still there so that uh, he can correct me if I uh, ever go wrong on answering the question of the zakat issue with regards to supporting yes. the media. Good mm -hmm. point. Because what I started is with the Battle of Tabuk and Abu Bakr al Siddiq donating his entire money and uh, Umar ibn Khattab donating 50% of his wealth yeah. and Uthman ibn Affan is doing so much, etc. etc. 
those companions did not earn this status with the Prophet ﷺ and before Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala just because they happened to be there, mm -hmm. rather because of their sacrifices and their strong will to do anything, whatever it takes, in order to support this deen. And in order to be with them and in their ranks and enjoy the company of the Prophet ﷺ, we have to carry the banner after them. قُلْ هَذِهِ سَبِيلِي أَدْعُوا إِلَى اللَّهِ عَلَى بَصِيرَةٍ أَنَا وَمَنِ اتَّبَعَنِي This is my straight path. I call unto Allah when I incite me and those who follow me. So if we ever claim that we are the followers of the Prophet Wasallam, then we have to carry this banner by every possible means. Shaykh Asim, I hope you're still there. Or at yeah. least you can correct me in case if I ever go wrong because I have been reluctant to answer this question for so many times until I review the answer with my superior shiuch, with the fiqh councils, with the fatwa committees everywhere. Is it permissible to pay our zakat to support da'wah in foreign languages, not just in English? And the, the conclusion was, yes, this is one of the forms of fi sabilillah, for the sake of Allah. Basically, jihad was prescribed in Islam in order to support da'wah. So if this is the case, our senior scholars in the fatwa committees have said it is permissible, especially for those who are living in the West, to support the da'wah cause mm -hmm. through the zakah fund. So I'm not caught in my own view, rather I'm just transmitting. I've consulted many, many shiuch in Egypt before I was able to give this answer. Sheikh Asim, what do you think of that? Uh, I have to look into it. Because like Allah khair. Yani the eighth uh, uh, source of zakah mentioned in verse 16 of Fi Sabilillah. Uh, some scholars said that anything at the side of Allah is uh, accounted under this eighth category. Sheikh mm -hmm. bin Aytimin says this would not be acceptable because the seven uh, previous o are also part of Sufi Sabilillah. Mm -hmm. So if we it, uh, open the door, it can be opened f for building masjids, for printing uh, books. Definitely or, not. Definitely yeah. not. Building masajid and hospitals and all of that, it is not uh, permissible to utilize the zakah money, not even orphanages. Uh, but uh, I the guess... Justification, I believe yeah. that the, justica the justification you've stated earlier has some sense of, of, of uh, truthfulness into, to it. I, I, at the moment, I am unable to give you a straight exactly. yes or no uh, answer, mm -hmm. but uh, inshallah, I believe that if you did your...